What is up y'all here in this one I will be showing you guys the solo facility card duplication glitch that is still working right now in GTA Online. The original method does require custom license plates but I will be showing you guys how to clean your freshly made duplicates here in this video. So with that being said, let's go ahead and jump straight on into it. All right, guys, so what we will need here is a MOC with a personal vehicle storage in Bay 3, and if stored in the back of the MOC, we'll need a free LG or any vehicle we do not mind losing. And in addition to that, we'll also need to own the facility with a Avenger inside, and we'll also need to have the vehicle workshop in the Avenger. Also, you guys will need to have a facility that is full of vehicles, including the vehicle you are looking to duplicate, like a fully upgraded Arena War Issy. Uh, so just go ahead and make sure your facility is full. And also, we will need to own a CEO with at least one garage floor. And you will also want to make sure that this CEO garage is full of vehicles. We will need to receive the full alert here at the CEO as well. Uh, and that is pretty much it for the requirements. Once you are here in your facility, you want to jump in the vehicle you are duplicating. Once we jump in, we're going to hit left on the D-pad to enter the Avenger. Once we're inside the Avenger, we're going to make one change on the vehicle, and then we are going to hit circle or B and then exit the Avenger. Once we spawn outside of the Avenger here in the parking spot, we're going to go ahead and just jump right back in the vehicle here, and we're going to pull the vehicle we are duplicating here outside. Once we're outside here, we're going to open our interactions menu, and we are going to return the personal vehicle to storage. Once we return the personal vehicle to storage, we need to go ahead and request a random personal vehicle uh, i'm just going to go ahead and use the mc options here to request for a random bike make sure you're not requesting it from the mc clubhouse make sure it is actually stored in a garage somewhere uh that is not the mc clubhouse uh but go ahead and pull this random personal vehicle into the facility here uh accept the full alert and then uh once you spawn down here what we are going to do is just swap this uh random personal vehicle that we're pulling in here for any other vehicle that we have inside the facility other than the vehicle we are duplicating so i'm just going to swap it for this free elegy here uh then what we're going to do is run up to the vehicle we are duplicating and we're going to jump inside of the vehicle that we're duplicating once again and we are going to hit left on the d-pad to again pull it into the avenger this time when we spawn in here we should spawn in here without the vehicle which is perfect once you spawn in here without the vehicle you're going to go ahead and walk up to the cockpit door and you're going to click on enter cockpit and what should happen here is you should get a little bit of a flash and you should notice that you do not actually get brought into the cockpit uh from here roughly five seconds or so you should automatically spawn in a empty facility as you will see here uh we spawned into a default empty facility here uh what you're gonna do is just walk up to where we exit and then click on exit the facility and once we are outside here what we need to do from here is go ahead into our interaction menu go to services and then we need to request our personal vehicle from the uh, mobile operations center, which this vehicle here is going to be the free elegy that I did mention that you want stored in the back of your MOC. But once the free elegy is on the map from the MOC, we're going to make our way to our CEO garage by flying or job teleporting. Uh, once we're there, we're going to grab a street vehicle off the street here, and we're going to go ahead and pull it in to our CEO garage. Now, once we accept the garage full alert, we're going to spam X or A a few times here until we see the loading circle in the bottom right as soon as you see the loading circle you're going to stop spamming x or a uh and then you should get a little flash of the inside of the ceo garage and then you should automatically spawn back here at the facility which is great from here what we need to do is run back to the vehicle we are duplicating here and we're going to jump in and this time we're going to hit right on the d-pad to access the facility mod menu we're going to make one change on the vehicle and then exit the vehicle and then if i just go ahead and uh, act like i am buying a vehicle and placing it in my moc you will notice that inside my moc is a duplicate copy of our issy here that we have stored in the facility and now that we have successfully created a duplicate uh i did go ahead and move the duplicate from the moc over to the facility here just to show you guys that the license plates on the original and the duplicate are the same exact license plate so if you were not using custom plates uh, your duplicate will be a dirty dupe and you do not want to sell dirty dupes so i'm going to show you how to clean the plate you're going to jump in a free elegy that you have stored here in the facility or any vehicle you do not mind losing and we are essentially going to go ahead and just repeat the glitch so pull it into the avenger make one change and then pull it back out once outside the avenger you're going to go ahead and pull the elegy outside once it's outside you're going to go ahead and return it to storage then you're going to call out any random personal vehicle from another garage and then you're going to pull it into your full facility here and once inside here we need to go ahead and swap it for any random vehicle inside here except for our duplicate all right make sure you're not replacing the duplicate 
And then once we replace it, we're going to go ahead and run back up to the LG, enter the adventure. We should have spawned in on foot. We're going to hit the cockpit. You should see a little flash, and then after a few seconds, you should automatically spawn out into your facility. Uh, if you get kicked out of the facility, that is fine. Otherwise, just walk out of the facility. Once you're outside, what this time, instead of requesting for the elegy out of our MOC, we're going to go ahead and request for our duplicate that we had just made a second ago. And once that duplicate is on the map, we can then go ahead and make our way to our CEO garage, jump in a street vehicle, and then we're going to go ahead and pull up to our full CEO garage. After accepting the full alert, you're going to spam X or A until you see the loading circle and you should uh, automatically be teleported over here to the facility. Uh, what you're going to do from here is jump in the LG you have inside here once again. Make one change on the LG and then jump in the duplicate you made a, a little bit ago here and then you're going to just pull it outside. And then once you pull it outside, you should notice that the license plate does indeed change, thus making it a clean duplicate now. Okay, so that is how you clean the plates. And once the license plate does change, go ahead and call out your MOC and then pull this in the back of the MOC to save it. And it is recommended to order a new free allergy over top of the one that you use to clean the duplicates plates. Uh, that way you're not using the same allergy to clean every duplicate. But that is going to do it for this one. I highly appreciate y'all for staying tuned in. This video did help you out in any way. If you have any questions at all, feel free to let me know down in the comment section below. And if you were kind enough to hit that subscribe button, make sure you do turn on all bell notifications. That way you'll never miss out on any future uploads here on the channel. This has been your boy, Hi Guy, and I'm out.